Today's Other People's Junk is part of a collaboration with Jamie Ray Vintage and my business coaching peers. Please watch all their videos and give them some love. Now today we are taking old shutters that I thrifted and turning them to flags for the 4th of July. But first, I have a confession. I hate fireworks. I hate to tell you, but I hate fireworks, at least the sound. Hi, I'm Jen from Rustic Rehabs. Today I'm going to take two different shutters and turn them into 4th of July flags. This one used to be my Jamie Ray Vintage stencil display at my booth, but I outgrew it, so it served its purpose well, and now we need to find a new purpose. I use and sell Jump Monkey paint, so today we're going to be using Vintage White red apple and appropriately named liberty blue so this one's already got some white on it but uh, we will freshen it up and these are going to be rustic signs so i'm just going to use a chip brush here i'm going to give it a quick overall coat of vintage white just to freshen it all up and then we will decide how we're going to do the stripes Blue and stars and all that jazz. I decided to do flags today because the 4th of July will be here in no time. And something got me thinking the other day about. Fourth of July and fireworks. And I love the, I love our country, but I hate I hate fireworks. I hate to tell you, but I hate fireworks, at least the sound. I think they're beautiful. I love that people love to get together. I'm not a big crowds person, so there's that. But uh, when I was a kid, probably I'm going to guess like eight years old, maybe a little, maybe a little older. We went to the fireworks in uh, a neighboring town and um, they were, we, we were trying to find our, my parents were trying to find their friends and we had to walk for quite a while and the fireworks had already started and we were walking like what felt like right underneath them and I hated it. It was so loud that I walked like this. And when my mom saw me later that night, it had bruises on my arms. <laughs> Does anybody else get like that where you're startled by the noise? This is an old metal shutter off of a house that I thrifted from somewhere. And we are just going to paint her up here. So after that, I don't remember, I don't remember my parents ever making me go to fireworks after that. I like to watch them from far away. We lived on a farm out in the country and there was a lot of times where you could see fireworks from several different towns from, you know, from the hills that we lived on. So that was fun. I mean, I think they're very pretty, but I do not like loud noises. So nowadays, now that I have kids of my own, I would take my kids to the parade, and then after the parade, my husband and I would tag team, and he would take the kids to the fireworks. And now we're getting into the age where my kids don't want to go to the parades anymore. The youngest is 13, so parades are out, but fireworks are still in. And now we have a dog who I think is my soulmate because she doesn't like loud noises either, so we stay home together. Her name is Dancer. And Dancer and I stay home together and uh, try to ignore the loud noises that are going on outside. <laughs> so 
So I've got my Junk Monkey Red Apple. It's a really luscious, really good color of red. And I've got a Paint Pixie little Frenchy brush here, which is a great detail brush. So I'm just gonna put on a tiny amount of paint here. And we're just gonna hit it every other, every other slat here, the paint. My eyes were closed, now I see clear as day, and I just wanted to say that you can take me high, feels like I can fly. Take me high. I can see the sun staring at you when you make that smile. I'm moving closer to you now. I can't get close enough somehow. And I was down until you saved me, until you set me free. My eyes were closed. Now I see clear as day, and I just wanted to say that you can take me high. Feels like I can fly. I don't need anybody, I don't need anybody else. No one will ever take me, no one will ever take me away. I decided I wanted to frame this one out in black. Let's see if see if that works. I've got some junk monkey black here. I've got a zebra round brush, which works really well for edging. And we're just going to kind of make a frame for our flag here. You can take me high. I'm going to take a course, course sanding block. Stars, they're going to be very primitive too. I'm just taking again the bottom of what's left in my can here and I'm just making hatch marks. Not perfect. And this is some General Finishes Polyacrylic Outdoor Sealer so that these can be porch cleaners or cover. Just so it's beautiful. 